there. I hope you're all doing well out there. It's been a difficult week for me. I suddenly lost my father a few days ago, and I thought I'd try and make a video just to keep my mind off for a while. Um, I've been on medication for HIV since 2017. Coming this August will mark four years. Over the last year, I've been experiencing a rapid decline in my teeth. My dentist told me that I have no enamel left and that everything I'm soaking everything up like a sponge. So my teeth are staining quickly. Added to that, my teeth are eroding. My coverage is not that great, and I had to pay for some of my work done last year, and I'm far from over. And added to that, with a COVID lockdown in the spring and last December, it's like a perfect storm. I came across a research article recently. This report was published in June of 2019. They found that wear in teeth in HIV-positive patients were higher than the negative patients. They say there needs to be a larger study done, though, to confirm this. I believe that it's highly likely this would be true. Medications can cause a dry mouth that would affect your oral health. Also, teeth grinding, teeth clenching, and acid wear. Depression and anxiety are common when people are taking ART. And sometimes your subscribed medications to treat this, that could worsen the problem with your teeth. They suggest anyone who starts HIV treatment should visit a doctor and get a mouth guard to wear at night. I cannot get into the dentist until the middle of March, and it's now the middle of February. My next step is to have either crowns or bonding or both done. Crowns are not covered, and I would have to pay out of pocket $1,000 a tooth on average. So I'm looking into maybe getting a medical loan at a low interest rate if needed. I've been patiently waiting my coverage to kick back in, which will be the end of February. So last year with the lockdowns and the dentist closing down did not help any matters. Well, at least I wear a mask at work, so most of the time people do not see my teeth. For now. It is Chinese New Year, and my dear friend Cindy, who lives there, is on holiday, and I'm hoping that we'll be able to have a chance to sit down and talk on video together. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe, and tap that notification bell. For now, Michael K. here. Take care, everyone. Thank you.